If your home was sinking into the ocean, how would you cope? Imagine waking up every day to the sound of waves crashing closer and closer to your doorstep, knowing that each high tide could be the one that takes away everything you hold dear. Welcome to Aitoro, Nigeria's disappearing coastal town. This once thriving community is now a symbol of the devastating impact of climate change and coastal erosion. Aitoro, once known as Happy City, now tells a tragic tale. It was a place where families flourished, businesses thrived, and the community spirit was palpable. But today, the story is starkly different. Rising sea levels and relentless coastal erosion are forcing residents to abandon their homes, their businesses, their lives. The ocean, once a source of livelihood and joy, has turned into a relentless force of destruction. In the words of a local resident, we've lost so much. These words echo the sentiments of many who have seen their entire world washed away. Our houses, our businesses, our farmland, it's all disappearing. The fertile lands that once provided sustenance are now submerged, leaving behind a barren landscape. This isn't just about losing buildings, it's about losing heritage, community, and a way of life. Generations of history and culture are being erased by the encroaching sea. The streets are waterlogged, the infrastructure is crumbling, and the fear of the next high tide looms large. Every storm brings new anxieties, as residents wonder if their homes will still be standing the next day. Yet, amidst the devastation, the resilience of Aitoro's people shines through. They refuse to be defeated by the rising waters. They're building makeshift seawalls, relocating belongings, and holding community meetings. These efforts, though small in the face of such a massive problem, are a testament to their determination and hope. They're adapting, rebuilding, and holding on to hope. The community comes together to share resources, support one another, and find ways to mitigate the damage. This is a stark reminder of climate change's brutal reality. The situation in Aitoro is not an isolated incident. It is a microcosm of a global crisis. Coastal communities like Aitoro are on the front lines facing the brunt of rising sea levels. They are the canaries in the coal mine, warning us of the impending disaster if we do not act. We cannot ignore this crisis. The evidence is all around us, and the consequences of inaction are dire. It's time to take action on climate change and support communities like Aitoro. Let's raise awareness, spread the word, and mobilize resources to help those in need. Demand change from our leaders and hold them accountable for implementing policies that protect our environment and do our part to protect our planet. Every small action counts, from reducing our carbon footprint to supporting sustainable practices. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to learn more or get involved, check out the links in the description below. Together we can make a difference and help save communities like Aitoro from disappearing into the sea. Aitoro was once a vibrant community, full of life and promise. Historical photos show bustling markets, children playing in the streets, and fishermen bringing in their daily catch. These images stand in stark contrast to the current reality. Interviews with local residents reveal personal stories of loss and resilience. One elderly woman recounts how her family home, built by her grandfather, was swallowed by the sea. Another young man talks about the challenges of starting over in a new place, far from the only home he has ever known. Despite the hardships, the community's efforts to build seawalls and protect their homes are inspiring. They gather materials, work together, and share knowledge on how to best defend against the encroaching waters. Local school children are also learning about climate change and its impact on their community. Education is a crucial tool in empowering the next generation to take action and advocate for sustainable practices. Government officials have visited Aitoro to discuss potential solutions and provide support. While these visits offer some hope, the community remains wary, knowing that promises must be backed by concrete actions. International aid organizations are also stepping in to provide assistance. They offer resources, expertise, and funding to help Aitoro adapt to the changing environment. The community's rebuilding efforts include new infrastructure projects designed to withstand the harsh conditions. These projects are a testament to the ingenuity and resilience of Aitoro's residents. Environmental activists are raising awareness about Ayatoro's plight through global climate change protests. They highlight the urgent need for action and the interconnectedness of all communities in the fight against climate change. 
renewable energy projects are being introduced in coastal communities to reduce reliance on fossil fuels and mitigate the effects of climate change. These initiatives offer a glimmer of hope for a more sustainable future. Community members are sharing their stories on social media, reaching a global audience, and garnering support from people around the world. Their voices are powerful, and their stories resonate with many who are also facing the impacts of climate change. Local artists are creating works inspired by Ayatoro's struggle, using their talents to raise awareness and inspire action. Their art serves as a poignant reminder of what is at stake. Scientists are studying coastal erosion and developing new solutions to protect vulnerable communities. Their research is critical in understanding the complexities of climate change and finding effective ways to combat it. Community gardens and sustainable farming practices are being implemented to ensure food security and promote environmental stewardship. These initiatives help the community become more self-sufficient and resilient. Local leaders are advocating for policy changes at the national and international levels. They are pushing for stronger environmental protections and more support for communities affected by climate change. Global citizens are taking action and supporting climate initiatives. From signing petitions to participating in cleanup efforts, every action contributes to the larger goal of protecting our planet. Despite the challenges, there is hope for the future. The resilience of Aitoro's people, combined with global efforts to combat climate change, offers a path forward. Together, we can make a difference and ensure that communities like Aitoro continue to thrive. Thank you for watching. Remember, the fight against climate change requires all of us. Get involved, stay informed, and take action. Together, we can protect our planet and support those on the front lines of this crisis. Check out the links in the description below to learn more and find out how you can help.